A dream of a sky. What um, inspires me is actually the youth. I know it sounds very cliche, but what I spend a lot of my time nowadays um, doing is looking for creative entrepreneurs and actually trying to build business capacity in them. That's what I do all across Africa. That's my real, real passion. Um, I do believe the youth is not the future, but the present. Um, a lot of people say the youth are the future, but they're not. They're actually the present because they're where it's at right now and they make the majority of this population. So anyone who says, you know, who tells you, oh, the youth is the future, trust me, they're scared of you. One, um, understand your value system. I think it's very important for young people to know the power of knowing your value system. And your value systems are brought up by all sorts of influences, but first starting with your parents, your upbringing, your school, religion, all sorts of things. But it's important to stop and reflect every so often as to what your value systems are because your value systems are what determines everything you do in business, in your relationships and everything. It's very important and it's also important when you're meeting up with somebody, whether it's a future partner or business partner or lover or whatever, the thing that will, the analysis you need to make is whether you share the same value system and if you do, you're on. If you don't and you still hook up with whoever it is, that's where problems start coming. It's just down to value systems. I am David Moravi, a.k.a. DJ Delight. Stand up, shout out. I'm a person who I like to address a problem. I like to, to speak about uh, whatever I feel needs to be brought out. Um, and most importantly, I believe that silence doesn't do anybody any benefit. So the one way forward is to stand up, shout out. That's my thing. In our language, use language, don't front. Uh, be real and, uh, and actually bring out some of these serious issues because art or whatever you want to call it is a serious form of communication. So please take that to your advantage and say something. Say something meaningful. Yo, this is the MC Africa telling you to stand up, shout out. Peace. My passion for music, my passion for life, and my happy vibes. <laughs> I like imparting that on people as much as I can because I think life is a gift and I yeah, just take it each day with joy and happy. If you have a talent, you should actually use it, don't waste it. I know there are very many difficulties that may arise, like parents and lack of resources and so many other things but if you really have a passion for something I think you should just take it and do it to the best of your ability. Yeah. Stand up, shout out. What I would tell them would be that they need to believe in themselves because the issue with the industry is that it's a very challenging place to be for any performer. It's very difficult to to start up as an artist and live off your artistry. So in that regard, I guess, I would, I would encourage them to keep going, to keep going. It, it will get better if you keep at it, if you believe that you're the best, then I reckon eventually you will be the best. So at least that's the motto I go with. Silas Miami, stand up, shout out. With the best. All things creative make me stand up, shout out. Um, art, music, acting. My advice would be find your passion and run with it. Stand up, shout out. Uh, my name is Tetushani. And uh, what makes me stand up and shout out is uh, I'm a djembe fola. I'm a percussionist, but I specialize in an instrument called the djembe. The djembe usually is played in traditional senses, but I'm going to be the guy who's going to take it into contemporary music. So I want to be the person who's going to carry that instrument forward to where you can see djembes with Kirk Franklin, Lady Gaga, whoever it is. And I want to be that person who's credited with having carried the djembe to that place. Uh, my advice to youth would be this. Before you do something great, you have to understand yourself. Um, there's a lot of people out there trying to copy other people. Because they're after this, they're after the cheddar, they're after the dough. But if you want to really do something great, you have to first understand who you are and then go out and do something that's consistent with who you are. You don't have to copy someone else, you just have to do you. It might be challenging, 
At first, there might be struggles and troubles, but ultimately, when you reach the mountaintop, you're gonna realize it paid off. I am Tetushani, stand up, shout out. Uh, yeah, I'm very passionate about music and about excellence and driving to be the best you possibly can be. And so, you know, on the drums or whatever way I can be involved in music, I just want to be heard and help guys be heard and inspire guys that, you know, actually doesn't matter where you're from, you can be heard and with whatever piece of art you, you know, may be interested in. For me, that's the drums. So, yeah, drums. All right. Uh, I think it's very important for young people to feel empowered and just like my partner here, Zam, <laughs> um, also quite passionate about music and um, just allowing people to know that they can play and do whatever they can, what they believe they can. Uh, so it's really important. You should never give up, that's one. Um, to always know what you stand for. People will tell you stuff, people will shut you down. Um, hear them out, but don't let it affect you too much. If it's negative, if it's positive, make sure you take it in and keep striving to do the best you can. Yeah. Well, I'm, I pretty much agree with what he said, but also the sky is as high as you set it. I don't think there's a limit, or rather the limit is your mind. And so don't, don't be afraid to reach out dive, however you want to say, take that risk. The higher the risk, the higher the reward. So, yeah. I'm David Gitoho. I'm Zamar Odongo. We are the Rhythm Section. Stand up, shout out. Love and music makes me stand up and shout out. Um, the love of being alive and truly grateful to have these awesome friends makes me want to stand up and shout. My family and my friends make me stand up and shout out. Be yourself, be kind, and live because you only have that much time and you need to make a difference and make it count. Um, my advice to, to like the, the youth is um, to never be afraid to dream. Keep dreaming, do you, and never be afraid to make mistakes. Mistakes are like challenges. My advice would be to go for what you believe in. Do what you have to do to, to reach your dream and, and like Melvin said, don't stop believing. My advice is they should all stand out. They shouldn't be scared of who they are and they should dream, dream, dream and believe in themselves. We are Lani. Stand up and shout out. My advice to upcoming writers is upcoming artists in general is to put in effort up to their craft. I feel that most people think that it's just about um, talent, but talent is is you know very minute thing, you know about about or rather. Um, it pertains to a very small thing as far as your artist life is concerned. You have to practice whatever it is, whatever art discipline that you, you know, that you pick or you're comfortable in doing, you actually have to put work into it. Talent, everyone has talent, but it is what you do, what you do with your talent and how do you develop your talent that will differentiate your, um, that you will differentiate you from, you know, another person. Hi, uh, my name is Omadai. Stand up, shout out. Well, for me, it's about the environment. Uh, when I was in uni, a lot of my friends studied environmental science and conversation and conservation. So just interacting with them, you know, brings that awareness. It makes you know like there's a lot of stuff that goes on and there's trash everywhere and there's a complete disregard for the environment. And I believe if you begin with cleaning up your personal space then you move to the environment and if every single person does that then you know collectively it's a huge impact on the environment as a whole so I think you know it doesn't take a lot to do it doesn't take much it's just if you start looking out for what is around then you know we can all move together as a unit I'd say you know whatever it is like go and do it there's always um, that what will people think, what will my friends say, what if I don't really make an impact, what if no one sees anything. 
I think if you feel anything, you should chase it. And you chase it with a passion. And there's a mentality of, you know, if not me, then who? I think that's that's a good thing, that's a good way to think. That's a way that, you know, it's not that you're waiting for someone to push you, it's not that you're waiting for someone to tell you what to do. It's just, you know, if not me, then who? So, pursue. Hello, my name is Gregory Lembe and Stand Up Shout Out. Art makes me stand up, shout out. It's it's an expression of who we are. It's it's us. We live art. We eat art. We sleep art. That makes me stand up, shout out. My name is Brian Corir. Stand up, shout out. Cause I feel, cause I feel so alive. No one can stop me, even if they try. Cause I've been trying much too long You can beat me down, I stay strong Cause I feel so alive Beat me down, I stay strong uh, Never give up Always just stick with it and do what you love Never try to fit in It's, it's not worth it, just be you Stand up, shout out mm. Cause I've been trying much too long You can beat me down, I stay strong Cause I feel so alive